two cheeseburgers, a deluxe. Yeah. And a deluxe, and then French fries, a milkshake. You want a split one? Okay, vanilla. Yeah. The Pacific Northwest version of In and Out, ladies and gentlemen. The computer's broken. Oh, it's okay. Thank you. Um, actually, I just want it. Let the people know. It's good. No, but what's it better than? It's better than In and Out. And that is factuals. Oh no. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Shut the hell up. The controversy. I personally think In and Out's burgers are better, but it's still very good. Right Only you would look at this and be like, art. Can I see it? Yeah, here, check it out. Dog. I wonder how many people have looked at me and been like, why is she wearing two different colored shoes? Yeah, probably a lot. I just made a find. It's the best wait, thing I'm ever not even seen focused. Okay. Store ever. $70. <laughs> wow, how much it's worth it. Alright, well, we are wait. in Sinistil land now with all these neon red signs everywhere, so we'll see if we can't. Sinistil land. <laughs> Yeah, you would act yeah, that's actually quite frightening. Hey guys, I'm gonna jump in really quick. Uh, for the rest of the night, I basically put my video camera away it got pretty dark and we went out to dinner so I kind of just stopped filming I did take some more photos though so I'm gonna put those right here at the end of the video this first one is a shot of the Pikes Place market sign that I got on the Bronica GS1 really a fan of this shot I like the red on the left side of the photo the green on the right side of the photo I put my lens kind of in a in a plant that was at this flower shop and it just composed really well and I'm personally a fan of what Cinestill does with neon red signs. I like the glow, I like that look, so I'm really a fan of this shot. The second one is also the Pikes Place Market sign, and this was shot from inside of a Starbucks, so you get a little bit of my reflection in the window, which I think is really cool. And it's on a wider lens, so I just love how you get a lot of elements in the photo, um, kind of divided down the middle. And yeah, I, I think it really captures the Seattle nightlife scene well. And the last and final photo is probably my favorite. I shot it at dinner with Alicia. I did some editing on this one um, to get those blacks really toned down to give it kind of a mysterious feel, but I think it's it's pretty dark and it's, uh, it's kind of moody and I, I'm really a fan of the lighting and how the hands are just kind of shooting out of this black abyss. Um, yeah, it's very mysterious and I really liked uh, the way that that edit turned out. 
So guys, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. Again, I really, really appreciate you guys checking these videos out. It means a lot to me, and I'm gonna continue to make them, hopefully. I think this is kind of the direction this channel is gonna go. A lot, of mo a lot more film videos and a lot more, you know, going out and shooting. I'd like to incorporate some action sports stuff in there as well, as I know that's, that, that that is kind of the root of my YouTube channel. So maybe we can get out, do some cliff jumping, shoot it on film. That'd be a pretty fun experiment. But um, yeah, other than that, I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace.